Hello everybody and welcome to another photography talk and this time I want to talk to you about uh, Camera. Beautiful movie by Jay Silverman that uh, I watched a couple of days ago and really worked. Before we begin, as usual, if you want to support the channel, please put a like, subscribe, share with your friends. If you want to go a step further, check out my website uh, and you can find my books uh, and you can find one of them that is a novel, that is Lasting Photographs. And if you like movies or novels with a photographic plot, just uh, that book is uh, right for you. It's Christmas, think to buy one and uh, gift one to your photographer's friends. This said, now I can talk about the movie. I was uh, looking for uh, some uh, movie to watch uh, as uh, I do often uh, at evening when uh, I'm alone at night, if I had a particularly uh, heavy day or something like that, uh, I like to uh, find uh, some movies that is uh, kind of uh, uplifting and this kind of things. And uh, I was browsing uh, on the internet and I found this uh, movie that is titled Camera. And uh, I'm a photographer, so when I saw Camera in the title, I saw that it was uh, about photography. I obviously had to watch the movie and uh, to be honest uh, in the last uh, years uh, when I look for a movie uh, I'm always start with uh, some uh, I'm not really convinced to find something good because uh, uh, we are used now with these uh, movies that are mostly woke culture, propaganda or special effects, uh, CGI and all these kind of things. So when I saw that camera was uh, an independent movie, I was okay, this can be good. So I simply decided to watch it and it was absolutely a great movie. The movie is about Oscar, a little kid uh, who is uh, speech impaired and uh, just moved uh, with his mother to a small town, a fisherman town on the coast. And he arrives in this town and uh, struggles to obviously uh, fit in the town uh, because he is speech impaired but also because uh, he is uh, kind of uh, different, he is not just uh, uh, a kid that want, want to go around and make a mess is just uh, a kid that likes to observe the world and uh, just sit on the side and look at the world. And this kid always goes around with uh, big camera, it's a twin uh, reflex, is a mamiya. So you see this little kid with these big cameras always uh, on him. And he met uh, Eric. And Eric is uh, an old man that has a repair shop. He was a photographer and uh, they met and they found uh, something that connects them. And uh, all the movie uh, goes on in this uh, relationship that is uh, Oscar, is uh, the struggling kid, with uh, Eric that is, uh, becomes his mentor. And uh, they both uh, exchange uh, a lot of things uh, and uh, they are uh, useful one to the other and it's uh, absolutely a beautiful beautiful relationship it's something that uh, we all had mentors in our lives and it's always uh, uh, fantastic to see when uh, when there's a relationship of that kind so it's a beautiful movie, by the way, the actor is uh, Bill Bridge, uh, the actor that plays Eric, and uh, really, great job, uh, Miguel Gabriel, the kid, and Bill Bridge, the, uh, the, the, the old man, uh, they are really doing a great job, it's uh, well acted. So, all the movies goes uh, on with that, and what really impressed me was uh, how beautiful the movie can describe what photography is and uh, it's not just uh, the technical process that uh, obviously is uh, described very good but is you know it's not a photography manual so there's something that is not 100% uh, precise but uh, what is a uh, thousand percent precise is how it describes the the feeling and the thinking 
and uh, what is photography, the philosophy of photography. So it's really, really nice. All the movie is filled up with uh, uh, little gems in the dialogues and this kind of things. And uh, what uh, really struck me uh, at the beginning of the film is uh, and really made me enter the the film and I think okay I must pay attention to this film is something that uh, is really present in my life and when is uh, Eric say to Oscar that is great photographers think before they click you have only 12 exposures so make sure each and every frame counts and uh, that is something that is uh, absolutely essential in photography and something that uh, we have lost with digital and by the way all the movie is about film photography uh, the camera is a film camera uh, 120 films so six by six with uh, with the twin lens reflex and uh, it shows uh, exactly what photography is and what we lost uh, in my opinion right now with digital and uh, because we lost, uh, it's not a matter of technique, it's just uh, we lost the philosophy behind it. We lost this idea that every frame must count. And uh, that is probably the most important thing that we have to get back to and learn uh, about uh, photography and film is a great way to learn. Obviously, there's a, this is also something that is important in our lives. In our lives, we are used right now to uh, always be busy with uh, something that is uh, not real. We are busy with uh, our uh, social media and all these kind of things. And sometimes we forget that uh, life is short. We only have uh, a limited number of uh, frames. And we have to make it count. We have to take decisions that are in the good direction. We have to make the world a better place. As photographers, to make the world a better place uh, is just to simply show the beauty. Show how the humankind can be beautiful. A lot of time uh, we see in photography this uh, desire to show what is ugly, the desire to show what is wrong with the humanity, the desire to show all these negative things. And uh, I think to make the world a better place, you have to show how beautiful are the good things. You can make a ton of pictures or movies about, uh, I don't know, the drug effects, and it's important to uh, show to the world and tell the world there's a drug problem. But if you want to keep people, far from drugs show them how beautiful the world can be if they are conscious and they appreciate it and they get able to look around and enjoy the world instead of uh, using drugs to escape it so it's something that uh, for me is a message that is absolutely important the idea to show the beauty and this movie really uh, bring on this message by the way, the director and producer, I think, is Jay Silverman, and he is himself a photographer. And you can see it in the movie. This is really, really important, because you can really see uh, the mental process of a photographer in the movie. Another beautiful aspect that I found in this movie is uh, how the relationship, how the two main characters evolve because they interact with each other, they know each other, they esteem each other and find uh, the common uh, ground of photography and their experience. So both of them can really evolve. And in life, uh, we all met some people that uh, made us a better person. So it can be a mentor or uh, simply a friend or some, somebody we esteem particularly. But uh, Every one of us has this experience of meeting a person that is able to make you be a better person. So it's absolutely, this relationship is absolutely nice. All the movie is filled of reality, real relationships between real people. And yes, if you look at it, it can be a kind of an idealistic situation, an utopian situation where uh, 
uh, everybody has uh, at the end uh, very good sentiments but uh, the world is kind of like that if you pay attention to the positive things of the world it's kind of like that and uh, uh, it's important in this moment where uh, all the medias and uh, all the propaganda is pushing uh, hate and division. We live in a, in a world right now where it's normal to divide, to insult, to uh, really show and uh, to evidence what are the difference of the people. So a movie that shows uh, that uh, we can get together and we can be real people with real relations and we can get over some uh, differences, that is absolutely essential. And somebody can see it is uh, an utopian, uh, idealistic thing, but it's always nice to see uh, what uh, the world can be. If we think about Plato, this uh, idea of the, the world of ideas, where you have the, the best of the best that is abstract from uh, the reality, and this is something that we need to see as inspiration to tend in that direction. And so a movie like this is something that uh, you look at it and you think no matter uh, what is the character of the film but uh, if I had to live there will I be happy or not will it be good or not and you think yes it's nice so uh, something that for me is uh, important that uh, there's still the desire to show that the world is a beautiful place and the people is mostly good so go to see this movie and uh, I think it's available on uh, a lot of platforms online. You can go to the website of the production of the movie. Here is a Jay Silverman production, I think, but uh, I write it here and you can see where it's distributed and all these kind of things. And uh, by the way, there's a trailer on YouTube. I put the link here and you can watch the trailer, but my suggestion is don't watch the trailer because it shows too much uh, the only things i didn't like about the movie is uh, the trailer because really it shows too much and uh, you want to see the different steps of the movie you want to grow with the movie slowly in a film way so <laughs> slowly and thinking you want to go to the beginning to the end of the movie and enjoy the process if you watch the trailer it's just uh, it shows kind of uh, too much and uh, and you will understand uh, how the plot goes on just from the from the, the trailer so leave the trailer there and just uh, watch the movie one good aspect of this film is that uh, if people ask you uh, what is uh, photography and uh, ask you what do you think photography must be and all these kind of things just uh, tell them to watch the movie absolutely it's express 100% the importance of photography you can see in the movie how photography can be important how the message that we give to the world with our images is important to make a better world it's important to uh, create uh, more connection between people. It's important to show the reality. So watch the movie, and I'm pretty sure that uh, you'll enjoy it, and you will be, you will uh, spread the word about this movie because it's really nice. Thank you for watching, and let me know in the comments what you think about the movie. And uh, remember, if you want to support the channel, you can buy my book, Lasting Photographs, or the other books, and you have uh, the, all the links down in the description. And put a like, subscribe, share with your friends, the usual things. Thank you again for watching, and see you next time.